Welcome! This is the first video tutorial about Comet Analyzer. In this video, we will show you how to use the tool for quantitatively performing Comet assay analysis of both silver stain images and fluorescence ones. Standalone executable versions of the tool are available, but let us show how to run the source code of the software using MATLAB. In the MATLAB command window, simply write Comet Analyzer underscore GUI underscore app and the software will open. Comet Analyzer has several menus including File, Segmentation, Analysis, Classification and Help. Let us start from the File menu and let us open some silver stained images. All the images are displayed with the black background. On the left side of the graphical user interface, we have several buttons and menus, and the first one on the top, it is the one for pre-indicating if the comet has tail and head, just add or just tail. We also provide several opportunities for performing thresholdings, like triangle and also thresholding, and improving the segmentation by deleting or shrinking the mask. Here, for example, we show how to define two classes of comets, one with the standard elongated shape and one with the rounded one. There is no limit for the number of classes that the user can create. Once that good segmentation parameters are defined, all the comets with similar shape can be quickly segmented. We also provide an opportunity to perfectly segment the comet, just considering the outline defined by the user as the border of it. To enable this segmentation strategy, the user has to enable the flag Comet fitting the free end selection. Let us analyze more in details the class browser too. Thanks to the class browser, it's possible to analyze the segmentation previously saved, delete them, and also change the names of the classes available.
From the main GUI, it's also possible to remove completely the class and all the segmentation that it contains by just clicking on the minus button. Let us see how to automatically segment the comments present in an image. We implemented a deep learning method based on 18 layers deep structure that takes the annotation and builds a segmentation model. To show an example of this application, we are using a fluorescent dataset and a pre-trained model. But the user can always define a new segmentation model, first exporting the annotations and then training a new one. Once obtaining the segmentations, called predictions, the user can accept them by manually selecting one by one the desired ones and saving them in a class. Or it can just click on the menu, save comments to the unclassified class. The unclassified class is a particular class containing the comments that are then automatically classified when using a classifier. In this example, we are creating a second class to then define a classifier able to distinguish between standard elongated comets and rounded ones. Let us see how to extract the features from the previously segmented comments. First, click on the menu Analysis and on the Export Measurements button. Two subfolders named Images and Masks and a comma-separated value file will be saved with all the features extracted from the segmentation currently saved. Now, to define a classifier able to distinguish the comets between these two classes, the user must first set the path of the comma-separated value file, then he has to decide the typology of the classifier.
Once created, the classifier can be exported for future analysis. Now, it's possible to use the classifier to predict the class of the segmentations in the unclassified class. To do that, first export the features of these comments and set the path of the feature file using again the training options window. Then load the classifier. Finally, we provide two opportunities to update the class of the comments. First, the user can click one by one on the desired comments and manually define the class according to the suggestion received. Otherwise, he can click on the classifying button under the classification menu. Now, it's possible to export for further analysis the feature file related to the classified comments. Thank you for your attention.